Hello everyone, my name is Ira Gamboa. Today I would like to discuss the 6.2 discussion assignment for supply chain, logistic management for 3.6. Week 6 theme is comprehensive integration of courses concept. Walmart supply chain transportation and logistic management in and around Ontario, California. Agenda. Today we will discuss the supply chain management, activities of the supply chain management, logistic management, activities of logistic management, and Walmart DC in and around Ontario, California. SCM or supply chain management can be a complex or simple set of processes that flawlessly integrate the entire system from the supplier to manufacturer, to the operation to production, delivery to the distribution center, to the distribution center, to the retailer, and finally to the customer. Simply put, it is the process of moving the product from point A to point B in a flawless manner. The process needs to flow correctly the first time and there is simply no room for error. When researching an excellent example for a supply chain management company, Walmart always comes up as one of the significant companies that have perfected this process. What are the activities in a supply chain? They are as follows. Purchasing. Purchasing is an organized acquisition of goods and services. Operation. Operation is a centralized management of the movement of goods and services. Logistics is the organized moving of goods and services. Resource management is the management of the resources to facilitate the flawless movement of goods and services. Information workflow is the ordering, returns, payment processing, or simply the overall movement of the information for the supply chain management. What are the supply chain management outsourced activities? They are as follows. Warehouse receiving, Inventory storage, order management, inventory management, order fulfillment, automated shipping, and return management. Let's go back to warehouse receiving. Ryder shows three third party uh, logistics for companies like Shark, Vacuum, and Ninja Blenders. Ryder Associates do their functions for the suppliers smaller uh, third-party logistic and fourth-party logistic are making Ontario and, and right to among the head, their head office due to the bloom, booming um, market at, and the strategic location. Inventory storage. Walmart, Amazon, and QVC hold the inventory of the warehouses for the suppliers. Order management. Have you ever wondered why the person uh, you are speaking to on the phone sound like they are so far? Well, maybe they are. Inventory management, Walmart, QVC, and Amazon stored and manages suppliers' inventory to the facilities. Order fulfillment, uh, lately we had the WFS, which is well, uh, Warehouse Fulfillment Services, which is an excellent example where in Walmart, um, the, the merchandise arrives in the warehouse but still belongs to the supplier. Walmart doesn't need to buy the item to be stored in the warehouse. The supplier pays Walmart as and acts as a third-party logistic for them. Automated shipping integrated as specific software makes it much easier and minimize overall payroll costs. Return management to be uh, competitive. Amazon now uses drop boxes by renting spots in other businesses to use the drop boxes for returns. Let's look at SEM versus Logistics by Sanders 2021. 
Simply put, su supply chain management is the collaboration between supply chain partners in strategic effort to achieve superior competitiveness. On the other hand, logistic is the function that supports supply chain management. Logistic is responsible for linking the, the marketplace with a manufacturing process, sourcing activities, and distribution network. What is logistic management? Logistic is the business function responsible for moving and transporting the products to the right place at the right time throughout the chain. Logistic is a part of supply chain that plans, implements, and controls the efficient execution of forward and reverse flow of goods and services. Next, let's see some of the activities of logistics, and they are as follows. Customer service, demand forecasting, facility location decision, inventory management, international logistic, material handling, order management, procurement, transportation management, packing, reverse logistic, and warehouses. What are the modes of transportation? There are water, air, highway, rail, and pipeline. Water is usually consists of boat or ship. Air is for airplane. Highway will be truck, vans, cars, and motorcycles. Rail will be for train and pipeline for liquid products. The Ontario Airport is uh, what puts all this DC at a strategic advantage. Los Angeles, Long Beach, and San Pedro ports are close enough. However, the facilities can still save money on employee pay because the minimum in Ontario under the San Bernardino County is less than the Los Angeles County. Multiple train route near and around Ontario Airport is also an added benefit for the supply chain industry. In conclusion, supply chain management handles the price of flow of product information and funds from the manufacturer to the consumer. Through the supply chain management and logistic, um, over, even though they overlap, one thing is for sure, logistic is part of the supply chain management. Thus the acronym SCLM is popular in the industry. Walmart perfected the art of supply chain transportation and logistic management and perfected the art of positioning itself where the business can and will thrive. This is my reference. And thank you everyone for being such a gracious, gracious audience. Have a great day.